I'm slightly concerned about this. It looks really, really creepy. But hey everyone, this is Lana. I hope all you red pandas out there have a great day so far because you are just with me out there and I'm here with an indie game called The Chaser. Now this is just a very early alpha, so there might be lots of bugs and things like that. But still, I'm rather curious to see what this is going to be like. And sh being chased is one of the absolute worst things I do now in a, in a game at all. In a horror at all, generally. And... A game named The Chaser. I assume I will be chased by things. That has a nice lovely photo. Photo of the family before everything went to hell. I don't know what the goal is. I assume it is to not die by weird creep entities that chase me. Well, the music is very well... Very intimidating, I must say. Oh my god. It doesn't help that he's breathing so much, and I honestly, I'm getting so very fucking... Uh, flashlight? Okay, there we go. I was pressing some random buttons. I'm actually gonna move... I have my mug of coffee here. Bad my bit with me. And I'm gonna move it and place it a little bit further, because I'm afraid I will flail around and accidentally knock it over. I don't know what what is the goal with this. I didn't really get a, a hang on that. I just know. Oh my god! I will die! I will die! Oh my god! Oh my god! No! Oh my sweet baby brothers! I'm. Okay, this is. Am I? I'm. Oh, oh gosh! I'm on the roof. Do I want to be on the roof? Is there a good thing? Should I? Oh, no. Uh, I don't think I should. I can't. Oh, I could jump down here. Another question can I crouch? Or am I, like, stuck here? I'm hearing pigs! Oh, they uh, turn off the flashlight. I don't know why I would want to do that. Flashlight. There we go. The question can I crawl? Maybe I can't do that. Maybe I'm permanently stuck here. I'm... Maybe that is a good thing. Me avoiding the monsters. And all that. Hello. It's me, your friendly YouTube Rulano. And then again, they mention that there is possible glitches and bugs and things like that. So that. Maybe this is one. Maybe there's maybe there is no crouch button yet. So I'm gonna go and... Go main menu and and restart it and see that fucking face. Yeah, you look like a fuck face if I ever saw that. And I can't do anything. Did I break the game already? I mean, come on, please, don't tell me I do that. Oh. But so far, first of all, I, okay. I must say that it looks really creepy. A very deep, creepy atmosphere and with the music and all that. So that so far is actually very well made. And of course, we're gonna restart a little bit quick. I'm terrible sorry about that. But, uh, as mentioned, the game is a bit. Uh, might be a bit buggy and things like that. But also because my computer is fucking uh, potato. It's a patata, as my girlfriend called it. Patata, patata. Oh, gosh. Yeah. I also, <laughs> also, I do tap down a little bit sometimes just to check so I'm actually recording. Because sometimes it doesn't record at all. Because I have a cause of my ship computer and I don't see that because I only have one screen at the moment because as mentioned before my other screen broke and I can't afford any new things and I'm I really don't like music should I well you didn't glow green before right I don't think it did is there a reason for that why you are glowing and making sounds my good friend machine Honestly, this is terrifying. I don't want to be here anymore. The only problem when I... The, well, problem... The, the little thing I do have with these kind of games is that... You are just in here. You, you don't get any real story why you are here. Oh, fuck nuggets. Hello? Oh, there we go. Uh, I mean, why am I here? Who am I? I mean... 
I'm a person. <laughs> oh my god! Was it you making sounds? Or was it something else? But yeah, but I'm I'm like that. I'd really love to have character and store and things like that. That'd be very important for me, so I really want that. And of course I hope to see more and learn more with this game and the story it has. And obviously now I'm feeling I assume I'm gonna start the machines that is around here. I just assume. I mean, why are you red? Is this some? Am I supposed to press something? I am good at pressing buttons. I'm a button masher. I played buttons in Don't Chat with Strangers, and I won. And then I got killed. I don't like that. Oh, I don't know. I'm in some sort of. I can't run at the moment. Why can't I run? Did something happen? There's buttons there. Why can't I press the buttons? Why can't I run anymore? Did I? <sighs> Though I don't have any idea what's going on in the story or what I'm supposed to do. Actually, I am getting freaking nervous. Try to calm down a little bit. But for some reason, I can't run anymore. Why is that? Did I break my running button? Did I? <laughs> what was that? Am I not supposed to use the elevator? Now I'm not very fond of elevators. For anyone that be following me playing Let's uh, Let's Play of Fear and the other kind of game, generally elevators or oh, layers of fear for that matter. Elevators are usually very bad. Very bad. And they just elevate the problem. It doesn't solve anything. Oh gosh. What's up for it? Is there a monster here? Really? Or is it just like a play on my imagination? I don't really know. It's oh no oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I'll turn off the flash. I hate when I do that. Because it turned very, very dark. Is there not an action button? Is there nothing I can do? I'm actually gonna check that a little bit. I'm reading up on things. Hmm. Uh, well, actually, I do before this. It's actually here a story on Game Jolt that actually means that you are Lauren and Jung Boom look for her best friend Kate. Following the events of Slender, the arrival. Oh, Lauren discovers that her best friend has been brainwashed and turned into a fairy creature wearing a white hood and mask known as the Chainsaw. After being knocked unconscious, Lauren awakes in an abandoned mental hospital. Now she must find a way out before the Chainsaw finds and inevitably kills her. Okay, yeah, that, now now we got a story. Now I'm actually that that I do like. Now I'm happy. Now we got a story. We got the character. We got the name. We got Lauren and Kate. That is the Chaser. And we have controls here, but it doesn't say anything about, uh, uh, you know, about if I can interact with things. I can only look around and run, but apparently I can't even run anymore. I assume there is a limit, you know, like when you hit the bottom of it, uh, it won't re regenerate again, maybe. Might be one of these bugs that is in the game. I have a feeling I will die very soon, because why not? That's how things go when I'm playing horror games. And usually I curse myself, I'm like jinxing myself, because why not? <laughs> I mean, seriously, the sounds I hear is freaking horrible. What? I don't want to hear those kind of things! That is one way how I would usually watch horror movies. Oh gosh, I gotta take a break here in the corner for a couple of seconds. Uh, but that's how I usually do when I watch horror movies. I have a very low volume because as soon as you don't hear much sounds, it's less scary actually. It do a lot. Or I would sit like with covering one finger in one ear so it kind of mutes the sounds a little bit and a tiny just squinting my eyes so I don't see so much. <laughs> so I don't get afraid from the horror movie, which kind of make not the point of the movie I'm watching, but still. 
that is like a defensive mechanism I have when I when I'm getting really really afraid of a movie or a scene or something like that. And that is why I usually react when I playing this game. It's like throwing myself back and throwing off my headset because that is my inst my instinct to lessen the the scares by uh, make knocking off the sound. If I do that, less scare. Though I'm already terrified, and usually it's end up keep me, with me dead because since I don't have my hands on the controls anymore, I can't really do anything, and I die. So I'm actually a very bad person to have in a horror situation because I would uh, yeah scream and cry. <laughs> I'm no macho man. I'm a dead man in a horror movie or a horror world generally. And I would be too worried about everyone else actually than my own safety because. I'm, I'm a potato head like that. Oh my god, this is making me freaking nervous. And still I can't run, so I guess I broke my stamina button or something like that. I depleted my stamina completely. <laughs> oh, please don't be anything down there. Please! Oh man, I haven't been here before. This is a new place. And why is it... Oh my fucking god. Uh, how are you doing, mate? That looks very comfortable. Can I, if you scooch over, I could lay beside you, and we just hide and smell bad. I'm good at both see both things. I mean, come on, I'm good at lay still and smelling. I can do that, pretending we're not here. And oh gosh, and there's always the freaking me mental asylum. I mean, in a way, I, of course, I do understand because it's always a big history with the mental asylum doing lots of shit things on patients and all that. At the same time, I feel like, oh, bad. A bit sad, you know. What is Is that the chaser making those sounds? Or is it those engine things that do? I have no freaking idea. And I guess uh, the game is still very early in the development, of course, so they haven't... I, I guess they haven't... Oh my god. They haven't... I guess they haven't really done anything with the controls yet. Well, like action buttons, things like that. And I suppose you will be able to crawl through the ventilation and all that. So I guess that is what they will have in the future. And honestly, I really don't like the idea of that. Because me and ventilation doesn't go well either. Elevators, ventilation, long corridors, things like that. <laughs> Sorry! If I found out you about the ventilation thing, but ventilation is awful. Oh my god. I don't know what is worse, that either that I haven't seen anything, or I just wait for the inevitable kill to come. Oh my god! Hello? How are you doing? You're smoking hot. <laughs> oh god, I will burn in hell for that. You don't look well though. Are you still alive or like yes death twitches or whatever you call it in pure English, Dutzrichnia? I don't remember that now. Or was you the one making the weird sounds? Was it him? Or she? Or whatever it actually was. Well, human, I assume. Or maybe that was Slenderman? That would be uh, interesting. But I assume yeah, that in the uh, coming updates and the builds and all that, you will be able to, like, I assume that that looks highly suspicious, like a thing you can actually push. So you can do something. Something, something. I'm not entirely sure what it will be. And of course, start those things. Because ain't that like from the Slender Man? There is a part where you're doing that. I don't remember. I think I saw Markiplier playing Slender Man Arrival. I think it was quite long back, actually. And I remember, because it was not only Slender Man, but it was a girl creeping around. And was that Kate, actually? That would actually... I mean, I love when people... Oh gosh, fuck. My brother is coughing in the room side and it freaked me out, man. Oh. But uh, I love when the people actually take the idea, like, continue. Now it's caged. Hello? 
Are you working out? How you doing? Well... You seem rather busy. I will not disturb you. Did you get stuck in the door? Oh my god, you're not pretty at all. Your your feet your you're like your one of your feet that looks very horrible but oh gosh it, it is her from the slender game right because I think I remember that very pale face white hair jacket uh, well shirt and things like that hoodie running around so yeah are we gonna have a problem here Missy okay if you as long as you're st was was it she making the sounds I have no idea actually. But as long as you stay there, I actually don't mind it. Then it's less scary, because then I know we, the worst would be if, like, like, turning around and then seeing like she's gone. That would be freaking terrifying. That would definitely get me. Oh, so now I'm actually nervous, because now I don't see her. Did she get loose? Would she run in here and... And worse is, because since I can't run, I am pretty boned. Really terrifying fucking boned. <sighs> she's still there. Well, I guess it's one of these bugs. I mean, there's... An, if, and if the creators see this, I mean... Now you know there's a bug here in the door. She doesn't get through the door. The door doesn't like her. The door, the door frame works with me. <laughs> what you gonna do about that, bitch? I don't know. Should I? I don't know what more else to do. I'm actually gonna see what happened when I go... Well... How are you doing? Wow! You're really, uh, yeah. Is she making sounds? I assume that is that she attacking or something like that, you know? Like she's supposed to attack? Uh, oh, nice, she's actually moving! Maybe I can actually push her a little bit to, like, yeah, get loose, bitch. Yeah, come on! Try to attack me if you can! Try! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! She actually got loose there a little bit. Will you kill me now? <laughs> I'm terrible sorry about this. This was pretty fun actually. I didn't expect this, okay? Uh, Kate, can you ride up there? I want to ride. Are you my like monster ride now? Monster taxi? It's kind of fun because I'm literally walking and she is moving with me. <laughs> well, two heads are better than one. Oh gosh, will you kill me? Can I get? I gonna see if? No, I, I'm literally stuck now. I don't. I can't get it. I gotta see if she can jump up from the stairs. Nope, she's actually. Wa okay, so when she attacks me, I literally stand on her. I don't understand this at all. Oh gosh, now I'm breaking the game. I'm breaking. Oh, I got. Oh, nay, I hit him in the roof. That is why. I mean. Are you gonna kill me now? I mean, okay, well, apparently, I have a little bit of problem here. I have a monster problem. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, well, 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 I think so far they have done very well with the atmosphere and all that, but uh, it's obviously it's a very, very early alpha and all that, so there definitely lots of bugs, and hopefully they will work them out, because I would I would be super happy to come back to this and see what's going to be in the future when they have updated and work it out a bit more. So thank you everyone for watching so far, remember to comment, share, subscribe, and like for more, and of course if you want to try this out yourself or keep it following, following them, then making the game, there's a link in the description box. And uh, I will be back with more games, more indie games, horror, whatever I can actually find here. So thank you for watching so far, remember? Oh gosh, I already said that. Yeah, I'm terrible, sorry about that, but my mind is a bit, uh, it's like buzzing around here now. 
I'm actually very calm now. now uh, being able to laugh in a horror game, that kind of ruins the thing, so yeah. I feel like kind of not so scared at the moment, so yeah, so see you later on, and most of all, have a continuous super great day.